<laughs> like free free to get <laughs> Hey Siri, please turn off the light. Just give it. <laughs> you guys <laughs> first of all the weather is so cold and my fan is on anyways <laughs> i remember i told you guys that i'll update you when i fall in love again i have not fallen in love but i'm smiling again you guys i'm so ah uh, it's one thing i'll just be smiling uh, what's wrong with me but yeah <laughs> i'm such a lover girl you anyways that's what i came here to tell you guys ah uh, my today what am i doing today yeah i'm going to school today as always what am i doing in my life except going to school and reading medical students but i'm trying to like balance everything obviously i have three classes today which i'm going to attend all three of them the weather is just being too dramatic well other than my three classes today my sister's birthday is coming so she wants to do her shoot so she's going to come over for me to do her makeup and then she's going to do her hair and all of that but now she's going to do her hair first then i'm going to head to school to attend the classes then come back do my sister's makeup then we'll go to we'll go to the place where she's doing her shoot which she has not still told me i like to plan i like to make sure everything goes like the way it's meant to go do you understand so and then <laughs> and then i'll come back home see where i'm blushing hey finished woman <laughs> and then i'll come back home we good your girl is good how are you guys how you doing see how i'm talking as if it's a live video this is my outfit of the day say hi, hi. <laughs> above it is while below it is the cerebrum as well as you bring all your content to the studio, Australia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, no, I never knew that you'd be a freak and a freak. Yes, you and a woman. This lady is not here. How to make noodles with this chicken that she remade for me? Just going to make noodles because I'm so hungry. Because noodles is now 1000 naira. I remember when I used to buy this thing, 150. 150 naira to 1000 is crazy. It's better you even buy spaghetti and eat than to make noodles. But my sister brought for me from a carton, so yeah. That's what I'm making as I'm waiting for her before we start the makeup. This is the blandest Indomie I've ever made. There's no onions. There's onions. Oh, fine girl, come and see you. Fine girl. But she's not straight in the air. She did though. You know keke that I did that. Who is to use keke inside <laughs> this kind of hair? Don't try this at home. I'm going to actually transition because I don't have time to be recording. Daddy, your face, face, cut. That's the time I'll do. Where do you want? Daddy, your face, This is 9 a.m. on the dot. I woke up by 7. I've been lying on the bed thinking about my life. Guys, there's a way you'll be broke. You'll just be drinking water for existence. <laughs> Good morning, guys. I don't even know if you guys can see me. What am I doing today? I have a fitting today. I'm working with a brand. See, let me just tell you guys the truth. I hate working with Calabar. 
brands, any brand in this car, they don't like, no, they don't, they don't like to press money. They like free, free things. They like, please, I beg. Let's, please, I beg. Please, I beg. Please, I beg. Please, I beg. please. I beg. please. I beg. You know that some of us, you know, they find children. I'm actually in my feelings, I cannot lie. This influencer thing is a bittersweet something. Today, I will just have one big fat account. Tomorrow, nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. There's a way you just be broke. You just start seeing end time. End time ahead. Because what manner of oh, atrocity. Other than my fitting, I'm just going to be indoors because what am I doing outside when I don't have money? You understand? The fit itself, if possible, to have happened here because I don't know why I would be spending transport to and fro. I'll book my ride, come back, buy food to eat. All those things will spend, I'll spend money. So I don't know. I don't even know what I'm going to do. I'm just angry. You know, as they say, a broke man is an angry man. I don't know about hungry. For me, I'm hungry, angry. Hey, best friend, this is the time for you to say, Oh my god, I've actually been very rich. I've been looking for a friend. Please just confess that you're rich. And come and take me out of this hell. <laughs> I'm going to dwell in bed and watch K-drama a little bit. And be a little bit delulu for some hours. Then I'll find something to eat or order chicken in public. Because that's broke people food. And I'm a broke person. And then I'll go for my fitting. And then sleep some more. Because people that go to school are people that have money. People that have money or people that are insp inspired to make money. As you can see, I'm closing all my doors, closing all my windows to get the room cozy. <laughs> to get the room cozy, to dwell in my bed. Because your girl, your girl, I can't go out. I cannot be seen outside. I can't. See you guys when I'm outside. <laughs> yes, I did not rot in my bed because I am in college. Oh, I am a medical student and... You can literally be chilling and realize that you have three classes waiting for you and that is my case for today i actually did not see when they posted the message that we're having classes so i'm just going to go also i realized i really do have a genuine healthy relationship with money i was just crying two seconds ago but i'm not sad no more <laughs> i don't know why i will have to feel guilty for repeating my own clothes I am feeling so guilty because this is exactly what I wore to Chicken Republic last night. Like, I didn't even change one thing. Everything, this, even the hairstyle. But, like, it's my clothes. Like, who makes the rules? Nobody. I'm going to actually stop by to do my fitting first before I go to class. And I think I want to go to the admin block for something. And what else? I don't know. Yeah, that's basically it. I don't think I'll be vlogging much. I'll just show you guys when I'm at the fitting place so that I'll show you guys the dress and everything else. Good morning, guys. It is I, Jasam, the one and only source of New York's gossip. Ah, I need to rewatch Gossip Girl. Good morning, guys. Anyways, today I told you guys a few days ago, right, that I'm gonna be having a shoot very soon, and today is the day we're having the shoot. So I decided to take out my hair since we're going to be doing an install and do a little bit of wash day on my hair i need to wash my hair so that i'll braid it into cornrows before they install my hair and and what else yeah i just have to get ready clean my room eat breakfast even though we're going to be wearing a corset i just need to eat breakfast earlier like now so that when it's time to wear the corset my belly would have food would have digested properly you know so let's just get ready and head to the the location call time is 11 o'clock and it's currently 9 20 it's currently 9 20 and 9 20 that means i have less than two hours to be there so 
I'm gonna do everything I have to do and make sure I leave the place this place by like 10 50 tops so that I get there and then we start with the hair makeup and everything you guys should wish me good luck that today's shoot goes well and yeah see you when I'm heading out yeah. Bariski once, once said, who is that one? Let me block Let me you. Block <laughs> you motherfuckers. We don't want to hear the other side of the story before you say anything. Another thing Bariski said, I'm about to take over. Oh, free Bariski. <laughs> Did you free Bariski? Like, I miss Bob so much. If you used to follow Bob on Snapchat, you understand the pain. Like, no Bariski to watch on Snap. Ha. It's only me that eats like a billionaire in this whole Nigeria. Nigeria. It's a big deal, me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Yes. 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 Anyway, I see you. I'm gonna beat you. I'm gonna beat you. Okay. Like, yes. Very classless. But I'm sure girl. that Bobriski is not in any kiri kiri. I'm sure he's in one confined Yes, me, I'm very sure. Bobriski. Like, oh, I thought even. of that this morning. So I was like, no, that guy is not using that. Yes. He's in one comfortable place. place. Just they don't collect and phone, not even. Yes. Comfortable place. Not like he's inside kiri kiri, like gong gong. Just be online on the same shit. Interview. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi guys, so I'm the model and everything. What do you here... do? Please just I need okay, your Okay, hi guys, yeah. my name is Jessam. Mm -hmm. I'm an influencer, I'm okay. a content creator, and I'm the model for today's shoot. Normally this shoot would have gone sideways if someone that didn't look this beautiful, you know, was the model. But oh, they decided that I was just too gorgeous to like to waste, you know. So that's why I'm here and yeah, so let's get it! <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Jess Sam. I'm an influencer, I'm a content creator, and today I'm the model for today's shoot for KG Bridals. Personally, I'm already in love because look at this dress, guys. Like, look at this dress. Like, I don't even need to say too much. The hair, perfect makeup, eating, dress, lovely. And the photo shoot is gonna go well, obviously, because I look this good. Can't wait for everything to come together. <laughs> So quick to reach out to the cook. This is 2 a.m. in the morning and I can't sleep because there are a lot of things bothering my head actually. And I don't know, as the insane person I am, I decided to set up my camera and speak. The two things are currently upsetting me. Like, I just had a conversation with a brand, right? And I told the brand how much I charged pay like a session for modeling and stuff like that their response was just giving it was so annoying because they said they have budgeted for a location which is very expensive as they said they budgeted for videographer they budgeted for everything but they did not think that oh let me budget for the person that is going to be doing all the work okay these brands take people for granted too much and it's so annoying i just told myself that i'm not doing none of that anymore like the whole charity charity collab i've been doing i'm not doing it again because it's just like modern day slavery another thing that's bothering me is that my brother is literally telling his whole school i'm coming for his birthday on saturday so i must come i have to just make everything go as planned which is very overwhelming i must say what else is bothering me yes i have school tomorrow and i'm currently annoyed with a lot of things in school a lot of things that i don't want to talk about but it just made me see things and see 
people in a different light then um i'm so tired bro like i'm honestly just so tired of everything like adulthood is so stressful like i don't even know who sent me to grow up so fast like where was i rushing to what is wrong with me i think talking right now instead of scrolling on tiktok is actually making me sleepy now which is a good thing i'm just going to turn off my lights and just play some calm music and try to sleep and stop thinking about the numerous things that are going on in my head in case you have not grown up don't grow up like don't rush anywhere there are a lot of things just going on in my head and i'm just so tired i'm so burnt out like god see you guys whenever i have the energy mentally to pick up the camera again because your girl is going through it but i'm gonna go through it according to megan the stallion i might be going through it but i'ma go through it period hey siri please turn off the lights just give me <laughs> seconds ago i was just rushing because i said estimated time for me to be at the jetty was 8 30 but today is saturday and there's sanitation in my state so it's lasting till 10 o'clock so i don't think actually i placed a phone call and they said that the jetty is not moving till 10 o'clock so i wanted to be there by like 9 30 but right now it's 9 30 i tried to reach there's no driver so apparently i just have to wing it and cross my fingers that when i get there by 10 o'clock or 10 10 they will still get me because i've already booked my ticket online and yeah i don't know it's not really changing a lot of my plans because i was planning to go early like 8 30 so that i would not need to rush anything but 10 o'clock is not that bad 12 o'clock would have made me angry but like 10 o'clock is not that bad sure. i pray for journey messages i guess they say if everything goes well i'm going to be carrying guys along so you're going to be seeing everything i can't wait to see the look on my brother's face when i get to or run i'll have to take join either i take a taxi or join the public transport because there's a bus that stays there and picks people to the city I, it depends on my pocket if the taxi like a drop for only me inside the car is too expensive i'll just take a public transport with the bus or like a shared taxi but if it's not then i'll take i'll sit alone then i'll head to the mall to get his cake and the things that because i don't want to only go there with cake because i've been in secondary school before you 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 will not want your parents to come with only something that will finish today so i just want to buy him like a carton of biscuit and milk that he would use and just be taking his kilka cars all those kind of things so after i get that before i pick up the cake an amazing brand sent me these cupcakes but it hasn't gotten to me because i'm not yet there but she's going to hand it over to me i'll tag her brand she's so lovely like this was a last minute decision to patronize her and she came she came through she came through so after i picked that up i'll head to his school i meet him and i thought i'll be able to come back today but the way it's going it seems i was sleeping on you and how bad could that be so i might just spend the night in Oyo, then come back in the morning because if i want to meet the last boat by five o'clock i'll be doing rush work and i'm a planner i don't like no i don't like that so Let's go. I look so rough. I just booked my ticket and my brother called me and made me so fucking emotional. The Jetty is moving by 11 instead of 10. 
but it's not it's not that far again it's already 10 30. my brother called me right and he was like mama are you and mommy still coming and i was like no there's no money and i like this boy you hear his voice you know that this boy was about to cry i did not want to spoil the surprise so i just said don't worry he now said oh no as you just hear him oh he now said paul you're going to get me something when i'm back and do something for me for my birthday okay and i said yes i will guys jesus my heart my heart literally broke into pieces but i just like held on because i seriously wanted to be a surprise to him so even though his teacher might spoil it because i told his teacher so that i'll be able to contact the teacher when i get there and i'm excited <laughs> Just three weeks, you'll be back. Oh, you'll be back, my love, my sweetie. Yeah, and if you don't want to share with anybody, don't share yet. Yeah? I'm giving them your own. Yeah? I forgot to do a room tour, <laughs> but I'm rushing out to go and eat with my friend. And I actually bought this shirt from the mall where I bought things for my brother. I also bought soap. This is literally what I'm wearing. I got this top at the mall for like 3000 because I don't want to repeat the top I wore because I was obviously sweaty and then I'm wearing my trouser again. Yeah. I said I'll talk to you guys when I'm back. I just showered. Bro, the water pressure here is so good. And this is the room I'll be sleeping in till I head to the jetty tomorrow. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I ordered. <laughs> yes, it's, oh, it's me. I'm the one that ordered the ride. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you guys, it's so funny. What a I'm back to the hotel. As you can see, I'm so tired. My friend and I we used these boats, keke, tuk tuk, <laughs> just for the fun of it. And it's funny. I'm about to lie down and sleep because your girl is tired. I've not even tried the bed to see. Okay, strong. Your girl is tired, like. I think this is my best thing about this room. Socket beside the bed. That's crazy, bro. That's so good. See you in the morning.
Good morning guys. I literally do not want to say anything and just end the vlog here. But I just wanted to say bye bye. <laughs> I'm currently going to be here till where did I add correctly? I'm going to be here till twelve o'clock. Then I'll head to where the jetty is and leave for color back today. I'm not going to be vlogging actually because I don't know I don't, I don't feel like vlogging and this video is going to be up today so yeah make sure you like comment subscribe tell me your favorite part of my month you know just be interactive with me in the comments and see you in the next vlog Mwah.